my name is Sarah Gartland. I'm from St. Paul, Minnesota originally, but I'm based in Dallas, Texas now. My name is Joseph Dennis. Um, I am a tenor. I'm singing Steva in Yenufa. Um, and I'm from Dallas, Texas. McKinney, Texas. Uh, I'm Richard Cox. I am from Chattanooga, Tennessee originally. I'm Brenda Harris, and I'm from a town of 400 people in Illinois called New Douglas. I am David Neely, music director and principal conductor of the Moines Metro Opera. Um, she's the stepmother of Yenufa and has probably raised her since she was a little girl. And she loves her so much and she wants to keep her from making the same life errors that she made. She's in love with Steva, who runs the mill. And his half-brother Latza is in love with Yenufa. So we have a love triangle. That's usually typical. This is one of my favorite roles that I've ever gotten to do. Um, I really love him and I think uh, what we see, we see this really good man who has allowed love to get the best of him. Esteva is, um, is a very important role in that he in my opinion, sort of causes all the problems. This is a very special project. Everyone's working very hard, learning their Czech pronunciation and diction and, uh, and the meaning of everything they're saying. Uh, we're doing some folk dancing across the hall right now. Uh, it's an enormously challenging work for everyone, including the orchestra, but it is just incredibly exciting. And it's great to be part of a team that's just in the cast that's so dedicated to making this something special. I think the music is beautiful. I mean, I think it has just heartbreakingly beautiful music often and interesting. The cast is ridiculously good. I mean, I, I, I'm. I'm amazed at how it, this is a really hard opera to cast, and Dumas has done a fantastic job. I'm always fascinated when people think that Janáček is this modern composer. We have to remember that this opera premiered in January of 1904. Madame Butterfly premiered in La Scala three weeks later than Yenifa. So, I mean, now granted, La Scala and Brno are two different things, but it's it's it, it's its own romantic sort of harmonic language that I think is so interesting and really gets under your skin. And it's a different way of orchestration that I've ever been exposed to. I think it'll be a unique experience I'm looking forward to. What I'm so excited about and what I didn't realize is the proximity that we are in this theater to the audience, which is phenomenal to me, that it's really going, we're going to experience the energy of what they're feeling so much closer than what you do at the Met. It's exciting to see something you've never seen before. You know, it's easier to see a Bohème or um, Traviata or something, but uh, Yenifa is going to be very, very unique, so I hope people will take the opportunity.